So I have three things that I would like to complete today. I need to finish my dress for Hashem. Everything is fine and dandy except for the bottom hem. I need to finish the bottom hem of this dress. I've been having way too many issues. I would like to <laughs> make these shoes blue. So I'm going to see if I can paint them. And then last but not least, and probably the most simple of the tasks that I want to do, I want to add a bow to my hat. Okay, so now that my spot and my space is clean and my iron is preheated, I can take this time to simply iron this forever. Uh, I just need to make sure that it lays flat, everything is in order, it's not bunched up in any way. So then I can just easily sew it um, perfectly along the seam to get a nice finished ruffle seam for my dress. And then once I'm finished with this, I'm going to go through and fit and sew up the hem again. I understand that the ruffles aren't supposed to be perfect, um, but they are, yeah, far from perfect, I feel like. Hopefully, with this next stitch that I stitch over the top of them, I will have some better looking ruffles. So we ironed this all the way around the bottom of the skirt and we have to sew it one more time. So the reason why this is such an issue is because the skirt is folded over on itself like this and we can't have this fold here. It has to be all nice and flat like this. And so we have to rip out the thread here so then we can re sew this area.
now that the hem is all done, I need to sew up the back of the dress. I was going to sew a zipper in here, but it fits over my head and everything just fine without the zipper. So I have the basting stitches in here that I was just going to rip when including the zipper. But now that we're not going to include the zipper, we can just sew over the basting stitches. I don't use pins because I poke myself too much with them. Choo -choo. I'm just going to put these here. Oh, it lines up perfectly. And I'm going to sew this up. Okay, in all honesty, I probably should have done a French seam here because this cotton is fraying like a lot. But I am so over this dress already that I'm not going to do a French seam here. So yeah, my dress is officially finished. I'll try it on. I'll try it on later when I have the shoes and the hats finished today. So now that I have the dress finished, I am painting my shoes blue. Um, I tried to dye them using Brit dye, but Unfortunately, the dye just didn't work out. So I have this flexible blue acrylic paint. I bought this paint, I think, to like test out on like a foam project maybe two years ago. Flexible acrylic paint, and it's very close to the shade of blue that I need the shoes to be. Um, it's slightly off, but I'm not being too picky. So I'm just going to paint the shoes this color and see if it works out. Because it's a flexible acrylic paint, I'm thinking that it will work. Um, I'm thinking like the 99 cent acrylic paints that I get from like Walmart um, probably will like crack and not hold up very well. This is my first time painting um, shoes like this. Oh no. Um, I should have taped them up, honestly. <laughs> um, maybe I'll paint the bottom to be like a different color because yeah I probably should have taped these up but here we are correcting our mistakes After about four or five coats of paint, this is the color paint. There we go. Not too streaky. It's dried. I think I got everywhere. Um, they're gonna be on my feet. They're gonna get dirty. It's not the end of the world if it's not perfect. However, the color is a little bit darker than I wanted it to be. Let me show you the stockings that I have. So I dyed these in the same pot as the wig and the hat and I mean I guess it's not that big, big of a difference it's just a darker shade I was kind of worried that it would be more turquoise or teal but I guess this will do I think this will do 
we like this this is fine so we have the shoes done we have the dress done and now let's go to the bow of the hat which is the last thing on my list for today prettier from this side right yeah okay ugly side is a pretty bow let's put the bow there there we go now we have a bow for the hat Okay, so we're all done for today. I have the hat with the bow on it. My dress is hemmed. I might have to fix the elastic a little bit. It keeps falling down like that, but that's okay. It's not the end of the world. Um, the ruffles on the bottom, I love them. And then the shoes, <laughs> the shoes turned out great. I think I prefer them to be this color so it breaks it up a little bit. Um, and then tomorrow we are going to tackle the wig i've only done one other wig which was for my wraith cosplay and that was so challenging and i'm pretty sure i messaged all of my friends and was like don't ever let me wear a wig ever again and here we are <laughs> we are about to style another wig so we will see how that goes tomorrow mm -hmm.